Hi everyone, I'm C. Maria from Founded on the Bible. Lent is here, and it's a season to reflect on scriptures concerning the suffering, death, and resurrection of Jesus. This is the 13th of 14 videos of our series on Lent, and we will focus on the impact Jesus' death and resurrection had on Satan. Today, we're going to ask the question, how did Jesus disarm Satan from being the God of this world? He, Jesus, disarmed the spiritual rulers and authorities. Who was Jesus disarming? First, he was disarming spiritual rulers, the top tier of the magistrate of angels. The head ruler of hell is Satan. Secondly, he disarmed authorities, the next tier of angels who answered to the top. How did Satan and his demons become rulers? Adam and Eve, our first parents, represented all of mankind. As children of God, they were given the position of rulers under God, and all the earth was under their authority. When Adam and Eve disobeyed God and ate of the fruit, Satan stole their position as ruler of the world, and everything transferred over to his authority. He became the God of this world. Jesus, the Son of God, was born a man and became the second Adam. Now Jesus represented all of mankind. He lived a sinless life and became the perfect sacrifice because he obeyed God. He took our place and suffered the penalty for our sins when he died on a cross. When Jesus rose from the dead, he conquered Satan's position as ruler over us. Satan could no longer decree the curse of sin to dominate over our lives or pass the judgment of sin, which is eternal damnation. The moment we believe and confess that Jesus is the Son of God who died for our sins and was raised from the dead, we enter into covenant with Jesus. When we enter into this covenant, we disarm Satan from our own lives. We regain position as children of God and authority because we are seated in the heavenly realm with Christ. Let's pray. Father, Jesus disarmed Satan and his demons by obeying you and living a sinless life. He was crucified on the cross in my place. Jesus is the Son of God who died for my sins and rose again from the dead. Satan has been disarmed in my own life because of my position with you as a child of God and because of the authority you have given me as I am seated with Christ in heavenly places. Jesus, you are my Lord. I give you my life. You may do with my life as you will. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed it. To learn more about Disarmed, go to our blog. The link is in the description. Stay tuned for the rest of our series on Lent, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon.